What up guys? So I'm finally back with another build. This time I'm going to be putting together this Furetech Cayman Barebone Fiber Kit with a bunch of these parts that I picked up. I'll list all of these parts in the description, but I'll quickly go through them now. Oh, and if you haven't seen my Deadbolt or C10 builds, where I upgraded the majority of the components on each truck, you can check those videos out on my page. If you are at all interested, of course. So for this Cayman, my first purchase was the Barebone Carbon Fiber Kit and the Lizard Pro ESC. For a transmitter, I picked up this Flysky FS GT5. I thought about getting the FureTech Avatar, but couldn't justify paying $150 plus, especially when so many people rave about this one. For the motor, I went with the Mini Komodo brushless and the Mini Stellar transmission. FureTech does sell a kit with the Micro Komodo motor built in, but I really wanted to try out this one instead, so I opted out of purchasing that one. And I'm going to swap out the rear links that are currently on this truck with these 65mm extended links. For wheels and tires, I went with these red and black Triel beadlocks and the Swamp King tires. And finally for a body, I snagged this Hobgoblin, which I'm going to paint jet black. This will be my second ever paint job, so don't judge on how shitty it might come out. The first was on this Hornet, which I built back in 1984. Yeah, you heard that right, 1984. Shit, I'm getting old. Alright, I'm gonna get started on this. Instead of boring you with the entire build, I'll skip through and show some of the progress as I complete installing some of these parts. And don't forget to pour yourself a cold one, if you're old enough, of course. And a stupid movie in the background never hurts. So I just unboxed the kit, here it is. Shocks actually seem pretty decent on this thing. Not sure about that steering servo yet, but I do have this extra one lying around, so I may swap it out for that. I guess we'll get started on the rear links first. All right, so I just finished swapping out these rear links for these new 65 millimeter extended links. Oh, and pro tip, add about a drop of this Andy's hair cutting clipper oil to each of the shocks. Dude, like butter. Really makes a huge difference. Look at these guys just staring at me while I work. All right, it's time to install the Komodo, but let's just admire this beauty for a second first. 